Hi everyone, I'm Mary J Handmade and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to crochet this super cute pumpkins applique. They can be used as Halloween coasters. You can use them as brooch and in general to decorate your home. I hope you're going to enjoy this tutorial. Let's start! To make your pumpkin applique, you're going to need yarn in three colors, orange, brown and green. A crochet hook, I'm going to use a 3mm crochet hook, scissors and a needle. Start making a magic loop. For your first round, you have to work 12 half double crochet in the loop. So yarn over, insert a hook in the loop, grab the yarn, pull it through the loop, yarn over and pull it through the three loops you have on your hook. So that's our first half double crochet. Now continue until you have 12 double crochet in your loop. When you have all the half double crochet, pull the tail to close the loop. Then end the round with a slip stitch in the first half double crochet you did. Now we're ready for round two. In round two we have to work 12 increases. It means that you have to crochet two half double crochet in each double crochet you did in the round one so insert the hook in the stitch where you did a slip stitch and half double crochet two the first half double crochet then insert the hook in the same stitch then repeat the sequence make two half double crochet in each stitch until the end of the round. I finished the second round and I have 24 half double crochet. So end the round with a slip stitch. At this point we're ready to make the last round. I suggest you to put a marker on the 12th stitch from your hook. So just count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and put a marker in the 12th stitch. And we should have 12 stitches on both sides. So now make a chain and in the next stitch work enough double crochet. At this point we have to repeat a sequence of stitches for four times. The sequence is two double crochet in the first stitch, one double crochet in the second stitch. So insert the hook in the next stitch and double crochet. Go back again in the same stitch and double crochet. Then in the next stitch just double crochet. Then repeat the sequence, two double crochet in the first stitch. Then in the next stitch one double crochet. And repeat the sequence one increase in one double crochet two times more. I just finished the sequence and now I have two stitches from the marker. Okay, in the first stitch work two double crochet in the same stitch. And in the next stitch half double crochet. Now remove the marker and slip stitch.
on the other side we have to repeat the same stitches half double crochet then for four times repeat the sequence one increase and one double crochet I just completed the sequence now make two double crochet in the same stitch then in the next stitch half double crochet and finish the third round with a slip stitch in the chain we made at the beginning of the round now cut the yarn and fasten off With green yarn, make a slip knot. Insert a hook in the last slip stitch you did. Grab the slip knot and pull it through the stitch. Chain one. Then work seven chains more. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now skip the first chain from your hook, insert a hook in the second chain, and work three single crochet in the same chain. Continue making three single crochet in each chain remaining. Then insert a hook in the same stitch where you attached the green yarn and slip stitch. Curl your leave, cut the yarn and fasten off. Now with brown yarn make a slip knot. Insert the hook in the same stitch where you worked the leaf. Grab the slip knot and pull it through the stitch. Chain one. Then work five chains more. Skip the first chain from your hook, then slip stitch in the chains remaining. Then insert a hook in the same stitch, make a slip stitch, cut the yarn and fasten off. Okay, our pumpkin is finished now. At this point, with black yarn, go to embroider eyes and mouth that will have to look absolutely scary. I failed completely my pumpkin is not scary at all but it's super cute and I love it this is the miniature version of my pumpkin I worked it with a 1.75 millimeter hook and I'm going to attach a brooch on the back of this little pumpkin and I'll proudly wear it on Halloween. Okay, that's the end of the tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it and you found it useful. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you crochet this project, please send me a picture. I'd love so much to see it. For any question, please 
you can leave a comment or contact me on Facebook or by email. You can find all my contacts in the description of the video in the info box. If you want more videos in English, don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe and share the video. Thanks for watching and see you soon!